Alright, so you want to learn how to do this. And this. Well, don't worry. I do too. <laughs> this is a horrible intro. Let's crack a lacking, boys. It's your boy, Gaster, and we are back on Hypixel to teach you guys something. Or, no, to learn something with you guys. Today's episode um, is very, very random. I want to put it out there. Um, I don't upload videos related to this very often, but recently I learned how to drag click. And you know, if you learn how to drag click, you're going to want to learn how to god bridge. It's like teaching a cookie to mouse. I did that analogy perfectly. I don't know which talk. I honestly really have been looking forward to learning how to god bridge for a little while, especially because I learned how to drag click very recently. Cue the music. Anyways, tried learning it within an hour. I, but I set a timer right here because I have my clock on there, so you guys can see that completely. And I gave myself one hour to learn how to God bridge while simultaneously teaching you guys how to God bridge. You're learning how to God bridge from an absolute idiot. So, I don't know why you clicked on this video, but you did, and now you must watch. Give me watch time. Anyways, if you guys did enjoy today's video, you should totally consider subscribing. I upload videos like this one every single freaking day, and it'd just be epic. Also, leave a like if you did enjoy, and let's get right into it. Pow. What is God bridging, okay? Um, this might be a question you might be asking yourself. I don't know why you would click on the video if you didn't know what God bridging was, but if you don't, let me give you a brief explanation. So, God bridging is when you take your blocks here. Let me grab some. <laughs> All right. When you take... Uh, when you grab blocks here, and I'm going to put them in my inventory, and you're able to press them in a rapid succession that you do not have to shift nor move your head. You know, I'm holding shift right now because I I have not mastered this skill. As you can see, I can do it a little bit. But I do not want to spoil it because there is an end result to see. But basically, just imagine seeing that but long. That is my best explanation for it. <laughs> I'm not very good at it. But, yeah. So, I'm going to teach you guys here how to God Bridge. Since I do kind of want to teach you guys how I learned how to, I got to teach you guys how to. For those who don't know how to at all. Basically, God Bridging is very simple. It's very easy to learn. You know, not it's very easy to understand. Now, learning it is a, a ton more difficult. But, you know what? We're not trying to... Yeah, not yet. But, here we go. So, first things first... You want to be able to aim yourself right here. My, my biggest suggestion to you guys to make this a lot easier on yourself. Instead of doing the F3 method, which is a completely liable method, where you go ahead and look directly right here at one at negative 135.75 if you're facing um, south. Um, and you want to look northeast. Now, I, I consider this to be pretty time consuming and almost not worth it in my opinion. You know, also it makes your game look weird. Why would you do that? Now, what I found here from watching other videos that if I look northeast, it is the exact spot I need it to be. You know, if you see on the top right here, or not the top, if you see at the top right here, it says NE, which is northeast. It's an indicator that'll tell me what is northeast. I'm looking northeast right now. I'm looking in the exact right spot I need to be in. And that is the biggest importance about god bridging that there is now the next one is obviously placing the blocks and you know if you can drag click that's the best thing for it you know uh drag clicking over 10 cps i found works best but you know what i mean you really can do this with one cps it's a ton more difficult i i was able to do it a couple times you guys see right there i got three very difficult it is, it is a ton more difficult and it relies more on your timing than anything else there is no need to comment about my desk appearance okay and anyone who does so will be shunned so <laughs> we're going to be applying this razor grip tape and we're going to be deciding whether or not it actually makes a difference in minecraft pvp or i guess drag clicking or whatever so let's discover uh whether or not this actually works boom Paid 20 bucks for this. Apparently, painter's tape works just as well. So, this was probably a huge waste. But, you know what? I bought it, and we are going to get some good old use out of it. 
How do I open this? Like, like, right again. Just open it. Like, so, let me see. Or not. Does it not count? They stopped, dude. Hello? There's only four hundred tickets now. Oh, wait, something else. This is so fast. Alright, so now we're gonna take the illegal ticket and. Yeah, I guess we're gonna discover. I just got kicked from the server. Who cares? I don't. All right. Um. Now I have to think about this. If I screw this up, I probably will not be able to use this again. So let's not screw it up. That looks pretty good. I feel like that's some pretty good placement. All right. Well, let's start. Let's do the test. Like most noobs, I begin on the professional, the professional server, because I know exactly what I'm doing. All right, before I actually start talking like I actually know anything, I want to put it out there. I have never God bridged a day in my life. I, I can't. The only bridge I know how to do is speed bridge. This is the only bridge I know how to do with any consistency, okay? The title is how I learned to God bridge in an hour, not how I learned how to consistently God bridge in one hour. All right. Uh, so from what I've heard, tutorials tell me you want to aim your shelf on the block right it's like oh shoot it's like 150 75 or something like that or like 125 75 or like 130 70 negative 130 75 like around that area 130 or maybe it's 135 oh i got a two i got two right there can i just like wing it Nope, nope, I cannot wing it. <laughs> okay, wait. Okay. I wonder how I'm gonna get this in an hour. I'm I made the I made the decision to title this video the way I did before I actually learned how to do it. What that was three! Wait! <laughs> Guys, God bridging is simple, dude. It's literally been two minutes since I started recording my video. Please. This is no challenge. I am a pro. We got two or we got three, okay? All right, boys, as you can see, we have made five minutes progress, and honestly, I, I think I'm doing pretty well. For a beginner, five minutes, and we're this far into it. We've gotten four blocks. I promise you, I've never tried. This is my first time trying to trying to God Bridge, ever, period. O only remember thing is, all right, I guess I have to admit I did cheat a little bit. I did watch a video before this. Um, but you know what? <laughs> it, it, it inspired me to make this video. So that is why you're receiving this video. This guy, oh, that guy's speed bridging. I thought that guy was God bridging. Anyone else God bridging here? Yes, that guy's God bridging. It's least. That guy's God bridging too. See guys, this is very easy to get a hang of. Okay. All right. Anyways, let's, let's go back to training. That was three. All right, guys, it is time for the 10-minute update here. Um, I proudly I proudly announce you guys that I have still not gotten over five or four blocks. I think four blocks is the most I've gotten in the last 10 minutes. And you know what? To go from zero to four blocks, I still consider that pretty impressive. But, yeah, I'm averaging about two ago. So, um, yeah, we're, it's still going to take some time to work, too. But I will eventually get it perfect. I just need to keep getting my... I need to get my angle right. This is like the right angle, I think. Maybe I should like show my thing. Okay. It's like negative 35, 75. I know you guys can't see that. So, I, wa I want to show you guys it, you know. But it's just like really difficult because my face cam. Or my, my hand cam. Frick. What was that? Wait, I, 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 need a, I need to look at a replay. Wait, that was really good. Whoa, 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 whoa. After further review, I think that was six blocks, okay? I think that was six blocks. I It's either five or six blocks. But you know what? No matter what, that beats the record of four. So that is what you call improvement, all right? And that's what we like to see here, learning how to God bridge in one hour. Now I'm gonna try. To, I'm gonna try to break down how I start got myself into a rhythm. So give me one second. All right. So what I started practicing was was timing, and I was trying to get the block before I crossed it, so it would be perfect. You see, I see it like that. Do you guys see how I placed the block before it? Like, the, all right. Here, let me explain this better. All right. So you guys know when you get to the edge of the block, you stop, like that, right? 
I was trying to time the block where I would place it before I, I stop, you know, before my character stops. So it would always keep going. I wouldn't have to worry about having to do this, like get to the plateau. And I was learning to like consistently do it by drag clicking with it, you know, where I would get it almost instantly like that. And after a while, I started getting into a rhythm with it. You know, let's go. I guess we can get our time here. Basically, I found that if I practiced the timing, I kind of got better at just winging it by seeing it and just placing it because I was trying to train my eyes where I would see that was four blocks j just winging it, you know, and honestly, I think that was really helping me. All right. After a teensy little bit of uh, learning, Apparently, God bridging uh, on Hypixel is actually different than God bridging on a God bridging server. Who would have thought? You know, one server probably has more resources dedicated to making God bridging easier than Hypixel. Anyways, uh, let's get myself some blocks so that we can try this on here because apparently it's a lot harder. Is there wool? Can I do this with wool? I feel like all, I don't know. I think wool make this easier. Um, all right, let's go with pink wool because pink wool feels cool. Okay. All right. Well, let's go ahead and let's just go up here. All right. Well, back to our practicing. That was pretty. Wait, that was four blocks. Honestly, I'm pretty much a Godbridge mastermind. What was that? Wait, that was really far. Wait. I, I think I really got a hang of it right there. Wait. Whoa, 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 whoa. Hold up. Re re replay. Replay that. I won't know until I'm in editing where I can officially judge that. But it looks like I started from 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9. I think that was 9 blocks it looked like. Um, I had a few uh, starter blocks and then I just went on kind of a roll. So I think what I've learned here, the higher CPS you can get when you drag click, like so, I'm getting like 15 here, it seems to kind of affect it. So I'm going to try to uh, replicate that. I'm going to try to get high CPS when drag clicking. All right, after about 40 minutes of practice so far, I want to take it up a notch, okay? I want to do the practice on the biggest stage possible. And you know what that means. That means I want to I want to practice this god bridging and some bed wars. Which is basically destined for failure because it is notoriously harder to god bridge in Bed Wars itself compared to a bridging server or housing. You know? I got two blocks. That's two blocks more than I wouldn't have had if I didn't try. Now, I personally believe the best way for practice is in-game practice. I believe actually, you know, doing in-game is a huge difference than just practicing on a server, okay? Uh, I'm going to drop, I'm going to drop like half. Let's just drop blocks so I can God bridge after I fall. All right. So that guy's just going to, that guy's just going to classic speed bridge to me and I'm going to, woo I got like four blocks there. I really like that. Okay. It may seem really insignificant to you guys and it, it probably is really insignificant, especially because Aqua is coming for me right now, but I really think, okay. This is making me a better player by doing it in the game. I personally think this practice part of this like video, doing it in game is going to be a huge game changer because it's a lot harder to do in game, you know? And I think it just makes it more difficult because in game, you I mean, on the bridging servers, you're not really afraid of the void. Oh, well, I'm dead. Yep. <laughs> All right. Well, Asa Asaius, congratulations. Good game. But I'm gonna try this again, and I think I'm gonna keep trying it till I get a really good game where I do like, or I actually get a good, nice God bridge, because I really think that practice in game will make perfect. And I just want to reiterate that this video is not teaching you how to perfectly God bridge or how I perfectly learned to God bridge, because I still have yet to really learn. The whole point was, can I follow tutorials that taught me how to God bridge in less than an hour, and would I be able to do it? Short answer, yes. Long answer, technically. Because really it's it's very it's it's very eh. Alright, we have right here. After completely finishing this video and going to go edit, I realized the entire time 
I was doing this video, <laughs> my, my, my keystrokes, which were showing me drag clicking, was not on the screen. So I guess I, I kind of want to re-show this again, just real fast to show the drag click. Uh, drag clicking over 10 CPS, highly suggested, okay? Makes literally everything that involves drag clicking a lot easier. So, yeah. Anyways, just wanted to cut this in real fast. Alright, guys. I come to you to bring you my final analysis, alright? I have learned a God Bridge in one hour. In my opinion, I think I learned a God Bridge within the hour. Now, of course, you may have a different opinion, which is completely fine. That makes complete sense. My definition of learning to God Bridge was being able to get more blocks. If you had a higher expectation, that's what you set for yourself. All right. Um, I personally think there's no way you're actually going to learn to be perfect at God Bridging in the first hour. I just wanted to see what I could do in one hour. And I watched a few videos before I got started just so I had some research to go off of. I'm going to leave in the description credited videos that I watched that taught me these things. This video is less about teaching and putting more things into perspective. Someone actually trying to do it because there is a plentiful amount of videos about people learning the skill in, in hours, you know, in a few hours time. And I want to say a few things, okay? My drag clicking is definitely improved a significant amount, okay? I think I drag click a lot more consistently since trying to learn it for bridging. I think I'm a lot more consistent with it now. I also think I did learn a bit about God bridging. I think it's pretty apparent in the games that I was successfully able to do it a little bit. I got a few blocks. I got four blocks. And if you compare that to me trying it in the beginning, I could not even get a single block. I was so clueless, it was not even funny. Only thing I remembered from the video was... The uh, 135, or, or oh, it's depending on the angle you're looking at. Uh, I hope you guys did learn something, or at least watch me fail a lot. I hope this was somewhat entertaining, and if it was, make sure to leave a like. Love you all, boys. Bang!